Jonas is putting the final touches to his latest painting. He calls it replay from Mother Nature, depicting the reality of global warming. I symbolized uh, the earth as the sun, and you can see that they are warming the, the, the warmness of the sun, and they are revolving it, but it, it looks like some kind of chaotic destruction. Uh, and this is all our fault. I believe that we human beings are responsible for all of these distractions. He calls this piece a new beginning. These are the yellow daisies that only appear in Ethiopia in mid-September as the country ushers in a new year. This work shows there is hope to save nature. And particularly I choose in this piece titled Nature Itself, he uses butterflies to show the power of nature's transformation. Regarding to, to all these uh, things, the, the, the damage uh, that we have been through with the global uh, abnormal climate change and global warming is four times that the damage that we create each other like war, politics and others. For some pieces, Jonas prefers to sit outside in the sun in order to get the effect he wants. In a span of three years, Jonas has created 36 paintings, all focused on climate change. He, however, says he does not put a timeline on how long it should take to complete a painting. He says he always wants to leave space to add new ideas. Dawit Tefera is always by the side of Jonas when he is painting. He wants to learn how to use his talent to raise awareness about climate change too. He is a very, very talented artist and he knows everything. He is always reading about art, about medical, about climate change. He is very good artist and uh, sometimes I'm calling him uh, Google, he knows everything. Jonas hopes that global efforts like the Paris Agreement on Climate Change will include more artists like him into these global campaigns. We all human beings are capable to, 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 to transform this world uh, if we really can see uh, the, the, the consequences that we have made. For now, he is keen on producing a private collection of his work before venturing fully into commercial art. Koleto Anyohi for CGTN in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.